It's China taking on Sweden in session eight, Group D of the Mexican. China plays Sweden. Sweden with last stone in the first end. Line two trying to thread the needle once again. Camila Norian just uh, overthrowing her last stone. Catches the guard. Yep. Still two for Sweden yeah, though and a good start. China picks up a point in the second. We jump along to the third end. Camilla Norén once again, this time trying to spill a few reds, but over curls, catches that center guard, leaves yes. China stealing two, leading the game three to two after three ends of play. And then the fourth end, Sweden lying two, a chance to draw for three. Oh, just slightly Hi. wider with the line. Find some fresh pebble, pulls up short, but two points still for Sweden. And they lead four to three after four ends. Fifth end. A party in the forfeit. And in around, as always, and mixed doubles curling for China. Looking to cross the face of the shot stone here, get in for three. Just can't quite. Get it there. Fu Weiwei. About two points for China. 5 4 lead. Single for Sweden and six. Takes us to the seventh end. Power play for China. Looking to pick up a multiple score, but left with a draw against three Swedish counters. And Fu Weiwei just coming up short. A big steal of three for Sweden. Heading into the eighth end. Struggling for time in this one. Looks like she kicked out the hack in time, but according to the official time clocks and umpires, the stone was not released in time. Didn't really matter though. The shot did not come off. Sweden wins it. Congratulations, you guys. That was a very exciting finish. You're now 2-0. Time clock was a bit of an issue at the end of the game, um, but you guys came out on top with a great power play steal. Tell us a little bit about that. Yeah, we have a plan in this power play at um, uh, two points we can tap maximum. So that was our plan. But uh, if we steal free, so I think we do the right thing. I think it was difficult because she changed the way we were playing from one side all the, uh, the, end. the end and then she switched the side and I think it was a little bit uh, uh, slower ice there. So This is the second time the World Mixed Doubles has been played in Sweden. How does it feel to be playing on home soil? It feels great. We didn't do so good at the last worlds in Sweden, but we we think it's good to play at home. Yeah, we, we, we like it very much to play in Sweden, and I think we have a real fun this time. The last time we was a little frustrated, so I think we, it's more uh, ready for this tournament than was in Karlstad. So. Great. Well, congratulations on the W, and best of luck for the rest of the week. Thank you. 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 Thank you.